Hi everybody, welcome to our Wednesday video brought to you today by Country TV, Sky Channel 081. We'll take a look at this cloud, plenty of cloud coming in with this easterly conveyor belt. It continues, and by the way, the easterly wind flow around New Zealand, no sign of it easing anytime soon. It's going to be blowing right through till about the 29th of September for many, many areas. So we've got plenty of cloud, rain coming through, heavy falls around Marlborough. It's a bit lighter on the regions either side of that, but we are seeing some patchy rain and drizzle moving into North Canterbury and also some patchy rain and drizzle around southern Wairarapa and parts of Wellington. And we'll see a bit of rain going in towards Hawke's Bay and Gisborne over the next 24 hours or so as the system continues to blow through. But the rain is starting to ease to some degree around the eastern side. Uh, we see here for Thursday's rain map, the low itself has finally fizzled away. Started on Sunday, it's been around for four solid days and it's finally starting to show signs of easing as we go through to Thursday, but another low is coming in and this is it here in the Tasman Sea. It's not a clean cut low with the perfect circle to it, but it is still a low pressure system tracking by and it'll join forces with this moisture. So plenty of rain and showers coming in for northern and eastern areas especially in the North Island, for another three or four days yet. The good news is the rain's coming into the areas that need it the most. These dry eastern areas will see big reversals in the soil moisture deficits over the next week. That's the good news. Southlands and Otago, mostly dry down there for you. In fact, you've got some of the better weather, as does the West Coast, with drier, sunnier and milder weather after what has been a pretty cold and wet uh, end to August and very start to uh, spring. As we go into Friday, more rain and showers around the North Island as those two systems join up. It's it's not overly windy or stormy, but some downpours around, obviously a concern for those eastern areas that have seen plenty of rain, but hopefully the downpours will be below flooding threshold. It's one to watch though, based on all the rain we've seen this week. Still a bit of drizzle around North Canterbury and Marlborough, dry for most other areas though, and we end on Saturday's map where the South Island dries out a bit more, the North Island still seeing showers around the place and easterly is blowing in for both islands still. Don't forget for the 10 minute long 10 day forecast, Go to Sky Channel 081, Country TV.